Hello everyone, welcome back to Quest for Fresh. So it's here, your Swati Vijay. And sorry for the late video update as I was a bit not well. So I took rest for some time. And today I thought to post a vlog kind of a video for you all. So it will be a bit interesting. So let's see what I'm going to do in my kitchen. Today I plan to share my breakfast recipe with you all. So I have already prepared the atta for my puris. Yes, today I really crave for eating some nice puris with some potato gravy curry. So it is a bit traditional South Indian kind of a dish. Puri and uh, potato gravy curry in South India. So here I have prepared the dough and now I have taken uh, some oil in the base so it will be easy to roll out the puris and uh, one tip is there like when I will drop the puri into the oil if I will take the wheat flour to roll the puris what will happen like when I will put the puris in the oil the atas will go down and the oil will get a bit dark in color so I am rolling my puris with the help of oil Here I boil some potatoes for curry. Let's peel it. It's a bit hot. Now my potatoes are ready. Let's chop some onion. Peel the onion. Cut into two and take the outer cover of onion and just wash it. Then chop the onions in small pieces and keep it aside. It's time to chop some tomatoes. Getting ready everything before you cook will be easy and even time saving. So before making the curry I am preparing all my vegetables. So here my tomatoes are done. Let's wash the chopping board and after that I am going to chop some ginger because in this curry the ginger gives a nice flavor. And after that, I'm going to chop some green chilies. Here I'm chopping some curry leaves. Yes, you guessed correct. Because what people do like, they just throw the curry leaf from the curry. And it is so nutritious. And I just don't want it. You can notice that after uh, adding the curry leaves chopped in the curry, it will just get mixed with the curry and you don't even feel to throw the curry leaves and you just eat it. Mostly when I cook at home for myself and my husband, I, I definitely chop the curry leaves and add it in my curries or gravies anything so that I can eat and fully consume the curry leaves. Here in a pan, I'm taking some oil. Now add some chana dal, some urad dal and some mustard seeds. Then you can see that it got brown a little bit and the mustard seeds popped up. So let's add the green chili and ginger. Now finally add the chopped curry leaves. Now fry it until it gets roasted. Now add a pinch of asafoetida. Now mix well everything. Add our chopped onion. Now saute it well. When you can see that your onions are got almost cooked, just add a pinch of turmeric powder. It will give a nice color to the curry. Now 
Now add the chopped tomatoes. Now let's both cook well. Can even cover with a lid and let it cook for 3 minutes in a low flame. Meanwhile, I am going to mash my potatoes. Just roughly mash the potatoes and it should have some remaining chunks in that. Then only it will taste good when you will have a bite with the puri. So I have just roughly mashed all my potatoes. Now open the lid. Let's see, yeah, my tomatoes and onions are done. Now add the potato. Mix everything well so that the juices should get combined with the potatoes. Now add salt as per your taste. And after 3 minutes, 2 to 3 minutes, you can add boiling hot water. It will reduce the time for cooking so you can see that my curry has got thick. Now let's switch off the gas and add some coriander leaves. Yeah, my yummy potato curry is ready. Let's serve some for me and for my husband. So here my puri and potato gravy curry is ready. Let's taste it. It's really yum and definitely you can feel that maybe it is very unhealthy in the morning to eat and all but sometimes it is okay to go and be happy with your taste buds. So today I crave for puri and potato gravy curry. So if you want more videos like this, let me know in the comment box and please do share my video to your friends and family and if you like my recipe, give a big thumbs up and I'll be there with a new recipe in my next video. So till that, take care. Bye-bye.